Greetings YouTube, my name is Das Wolfen and this is my first walkthrough video for my Brotherhood of Steel mechanical operations based here at the Boston Airport. Uh, this build is heavily modded and uses console commands for some item placement. I will provide a link to a list of all the installed mods in the video description. Uh, remember this is a work in progress so there are some things I consider incomplete. I haven't moved any settlers into the base as of yet but when I do, uh, they will all be members of the Brotherhood of Steel in good standing. If you like this, please throw it a like. I will be doing more videos in the future, so please, please subscribe. You can also follow me at, on Twitter at, at @doswolfen, and catch occasional live screens on my Twitch channel. All the links will be provided below. Now, without further ado, let's take a look at this uh, brand new base. Well, sorry about that. I left the menus on. I'll turn them off. As you can see, when you... When you come down the road to see the base, you're greeted by a large Brotherhood of Steel sign and a giant flapping Brotherhood of Steel flag. You can see the main entrance to the Brotherhood of Steel area down there. All right, this base is split up into a few areas. We'll go over here to the uh, mechanical operations side. See, I've got some racks for some power armor. And uh, we're just bringing shipments of stuff in. In here is my robot work area with uh, stuff scavenged from uh, mechanics lair. Mechanic, uh, mechanist lair. Sorry about that. Got my workbench over here. Some storage. Uh, another workbench here for. Uh, Claiming uh, parts. This is part of the North uh, Northland Diggers mod. This is another another one of the Northland Digger mods. It's a, the Northland Garage. It uh, obviously scavenged more parts for me. All right. This over here is the Traders public area. It's where I uh, envision people coming in to the base. You know, we got a uh, restaurant here serving meat. We got the bar, ice chest, uh, places to sit and eat. Also got a general trader. clinic for any of the people who come in it's not feeling well back over here is a work another work area uh, this is for uh, ammunition rep reclamation and I got my work benches and that's scouter Also got clothing sales, and here are the restrooms, because you can't have public facilities without a restroom. So the ladies will skip that one. Here's the men's. As you can see, the restroom is fully stocked with a shower, mirror, sink, working sink. Got to have running water. and working toilets. In case you really gotta go.
All right, now upstairs. The first area we're gonna look at is the small public housing gar uh, gathering area. You know, this is for uh, traders that come in so they have a place to sleep. Got some guard stations here. This leads to a restricted area. Which is my power generation facility. You can see I've got uh, four massive generators, all providing power for this base. And as you look, you can see the defenses uh, were rather well defended here as to be expected of a Brotherhood base. And uh, now we're going to take a look at the... Uh, got over here, this is the... Uh, uh, you can see... Nice, nice view of Boston here. What's left of Boston, anyway. With another guard station. As you can see, the wall goes all the way around the building. And here is the barracks area. Now, normally, when nobody's here, this, or when, uh, you know, this would be closed off so nobody can get here. But as you can see, we've got the uh, barracks tables, small kitchen area, got to have that Nuka-Cola, some workstation. Now this is the back entrance. As you can see, it goes right into the future spot for uh, Liberty Prime. place to work on your armor and your weapons. And we have our own quartermaster down here. As you can see, he's fully stocked with armor, weapons, all sorts of goodies. And he's even got a uh, his little cubby hole where he can sleep with his own light. All right, well, that's pretty much it right now. Um, hope you enjoyed the tour. Thanks for watching, and if you like it, be sure to throw it a like, and uh, uh, be sure to subscribe. I look forward to doing more, more videos for you guys. Have a good day.